first to know and send PTV. Ajabo, Ajabo, Aja, Enya, Ababi, do, and then a democracy hub are uh, led by Oliver Baker, Vemawo, and then in call for a Nipa Makoma for 42 uh, Ghana Police Service, Etimi, Etse, or Mono, and then. And uh, according to her, we must be arranging in batches because now one adult from NT one ending car sentence say first batch, second batch NT, and then and a nipa eleven a uh, aka led by Oliver Baker Vemao. Yeah, the one a coco piemu a court na yeah the one a coco piemu a court na a yeah they say a lawyer ah onu ejinem edema Oliver Baker Vemao lawyer Martin Pebu edi tu just say enka impo. Court on and share Oliver and heart condition. Nanka won intimate in your so cry in your own. And so, Judge, you know, edit on and say, Nipa are waiting me a car cause. I say, my mother didn't three days here now. Yare and now they say, you be down into send Nipa living so I want a coco pee more win. Judge, you know, edit to just a one so unfortunate a bank cocoon for 14 days, two weeks. Na one abana ya twas and meeting to so far. A nipa forty two na ya che one edi one a copy more court in an court on eti mi amu bia two weeks se unko remind na after that no na ya twaso edi asem because prosecutors are a coco pie mu or what it just say say ye die protesters in no mukwa one enim baby a bibri no ete and I feel so say nipa no one enim baby or te dia se wama court or crani a kasi unko chana a bear dainty. One extra court and I say, on for one concoctionary remind. Nessa one eighty million one she shall move a year na two weeks time. And I bet was so at the assembly. Now, second battle, no, I had the one a coco pee move or court. No, say, your back I are na lady back could be womb. Ah, na your friend of Vera, I a back I are not in mammy. A general who is soon send a banner and in four months. And a yatseno, a court, no, as I a castle, young fan and court. And call remind for two weeks now before answering a better person. Oh, yeah, young court me and call video neck a crana. So, swam pass a very on him and answer on him. Oh, be on him for man say and on a fool a bear young court and call video no cacra. And see, I wish you for video, no, and I'm who say na a chebu na a proxy for a crew crowd, no, I mean, no, in a moon, and a very unanswer a castle, or no crowd, the demonstration, or no, and come home, or corner baby, and a yetimi a chain, and so videos are a big one, and there the pifes are very a cahon, a wabra, now one a she, and PP, a man you call no, a flag, a flag, and on a Nipa Bibre, especially NDC, a man you call no, I shall see a raising concern, and say, Obia or Yamon so dear. I didn't think a court or no unquency that are still a one at a bill, no, I didn't cook up here. I will remind, say, on conquer them two weeks na and no, and a deputy attorney general, you were Alfred to a year boy, Edia to a just a sansom no man for now, one eke canoe, and yard, yes, and Ukrabia, a womb because time or I yet say, sir, democracy have protested, see, a yard, yes, sir. Uh, one edin can call them by three two days and suffer now one a baby pmo a court now one enya acquire for lawyers lawyers baby pmo a court on one anka se on him on one anka se mu enya acquire any cids for no etche chen komo on one so anfa and two jase on him until se a court on a team edit two jase onko na onko onko them two weeks and sa ena ni mame e de baby two e jase on him now the question is e di enti ena very I'm fan to a lawyer and I say CID for no enemy say on him because Oliver Baker Vema or a coco PMO or how are the two just and one don't know a idea say a proxy for no a table in the coco PMO or hospital and a DNT and a Vera and so any not went to me and can and no and according to Attorney General Deputy Attorney General you are Alfred Triabua at the air to a just say on whom she shame our way in a BBN where there the prefer say lady I have friend very on him. Sanso and a Jennifer Queen so the Ababa to just say and now they send a crib ya a woman say lady and him now a DNT and a deputy attorney general era Alfred Triabua Eddie to just say Mame Vera on him now. Yanko 
uh, Alfred Tuayebo and Sam are already to Adrian. Or say the Office of the Attorney General has expressed disappointment over the failure of lawyers representing Vera, a pregnant protester, to inform the court of the pregnancy during her bill. Vera, who is four months pregnant, was arrested during a democracy hub demonstration and subsequently remanded in custody for two weeks. Deputy Attorney General Alfred Tuayeboa, speaking, Stress that it is the responsibility of the defense counsel to inform the court of their client client pregnancy. And the deputy attorney general said, "You say, you are there for lawyers at the moment. You know, a black cry, a man, a Vera, a tourist remind you know, you are there for the lawyers. You know, at the time without raising any concern. And the none lawyers you know, you are one. I say one any aware. And I say Vera, and I will say Uchicha at the edge of the house on him." He explained that the court cannot independently verify such details, and if the lawyers had made this known, it could have been taken into account when deciding whether to grant bail. Mr. Tia Yeboa clarified that while the law mandates the disclosure of pregnancy during sentences, there, there is no explicit requirement for it during bail application. However, he emphasized that informing the court of such important factors could influence the court decision. He criticized Vera's legal team for neglecting their duty to disclose her condition, thereby depriving the court of crucial information that could have impacted her bail status. And see, the whole question, ah, na Attorney General Pese Obisa Ewoho NSA Senka legal counsel for Vera intimidated to court to and him say Enka Onyema no. And then, court in the bed, near Qua, a cocasse, and Ca Uncoprana, Uncoya pregnancy test, near found confirm himself on him, and answer on him, and Sana, court on etimi, I consider the decision because court no etimi, and shut a cream, a muse, Vera, and your man, I said on him, I did a pregnancy test, and I bet the Nasa, and Ca cancel no, and so etimi the tow court on him, and then your quiet test, you know. And then, and you know, credit and access and can want a chance. So, maybe that is the reason why in TR one so anti me and fan to court. You know, and he stated on this issue about the pregnant person whether she is pregnant or not, it is not something that I can confirm for now. But the law on this matters is very clear now. When someone is pregnant and she stood before a law court. And the court is considering whether to grant bail or not to grant bail. The lawyer of a certain accused person must make it known to the court that his client is pregnant and provide the evidence into aha and a problem no one because one year for case vera and him nurse your court near correction nurse on your man and also private me action contempt of court and answer on so what you mean about all about the charm trust on him and answer on him. So the court, considering the bail application, they want to look at that aspect of it, but the court are also mandated by law when they convict a female person and it is about to sentence the female, the court is mandated to inquire whether the female, that accused person, is pregnant. So when it comes to the grant of bail, the law does not mandate the judge to inquire, but when it comes to sentencing, that is where the judge preferred to do that. On this particular case, I have checked whether the attorneys who were in the court yesterday and from what we have been told, the issue of the pregnancy of an accused person never came up in court for the court consideration. And so if indeed one of the accused persons is pregnant, then the counsel for that accused person feels it is his duty to disclose that information to the court. So if there is any blame, I would rather lay it on the doorstep of a lawyer for that accused person. And I have gone to the extent also to find out from the CID that information of pregnancy came to be a notice. Whether that accused person disclosed to them that she was pregnant and there is nothing from their end to that effect. And the Deputy Attorney General, you are Alfred Tuayeboa, and so so on. One case, a banana, a cocoa, 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 a 
when to me am so say on informants that now the video now kasa na mo share no say mo judge by myself a vera on him and ask on him katasum mo aso e na wo ye and ask enye katasum mo mo e mo e bia de enti a won to me am fa unto dwane say before and sign a court in the bit me agia to me e wo say utime the evidence a e bia dance e ba say on him ti e do be call hospital e mo akwa akwa check it I just say onion, and I say onion. They are say onion. They are not just say oh, I be track court, you know. And so that is why I end these lawyers at a bebo. So democracy have protested. See, a chief by one end to me, and for end to a jar and on to me. No, because the only part forty two, you know, court, you know, at the two be an say uncle, na uncle pay more remind for two weeks. Na yaba, na yaba betwa asem no eso. Tonight, the Accra Circuit Court has remanded Oliver Bakavomawo, leader of the Stop Galamsin Now demonstration, along with 11 others, into police custody for two weeks. The court's decision follows submissions from the prosecution, which argued that the accused individuals pose a flight risk and should not be granted bail. The group, including Vomawa was arrested following their participation in the Stop Galamsey Now protest, which sought to draw attention to the government's inaction against illegal mining, commonly referred to as Galamsey. During the hearing, the prosecution argued again that the 12 accused individuals, if released, could flee the jurisdiction before their trial. According to the prosecution, the remand was necessary to ensure that they remain available to face justice. Prosecutors also dismissed claims of mistreatment and overcrowding in police cells. Elvis Ander, a man who has been following the story and was in court today, join us with further details. Elvis Ander, many thanks for your time. Um, let me start by asking you what transpired in court. The argument was basically to um, ask for remand for the 12 accused persons, including um, Oliver Bakav, actually not, um, it was in court today. Um, we were expected to have Oliver and then um, Fanny Otu in court today, but unfortunately, Fanny Otu could not come because he's still ill and receiving treatment at the moment. Now, let me take you to what prosecution said. Prosecution is the, um, indicated that, yes, indeed, they have been able to take care of the accused persons, including their feeding. The prosecution debunked claims that they were um, not treating the arrested person or the accused too well. They also debunked claims that they have not been able to feed the accused person to their satisfaction. And so based on this, um, they are advancing to say that, yes, indeed, they can be able to cater for the accused person if they are still in their custody because mm. investigations are being furthered on. Aside Aside that, to Fred, the mm. prosecution indicated that the court should look at some factors. The factor number one has to do with the character of the accused persons. Factor number two has to do with their character, um, whether they are coming from a good home. And then another uh, factor that the, acu the prosecution indicated that the court looks at before giving them bail is that they should also consider the fact that these accused persons have... Um, unlawfully been detained have been detained unlawfully because they, they are they have been detained unlawfully because they are posting posing a flight risk now let's look at what prosecution also indicated again mm. prosecution indicated that if the court grants them the bill it will further hinder their investigations because they are not having a permanent place of abode aside they're not having a permanent place of abode they the arrest that was done initially has to do with the fact that they gathered at a place where they are not supposed to gather. That is unlawful gathering. And so the court should look at the offenses around these persons who have been accused. That is the 12 persons. And then decide on whether or not they should be granted bail. Now, objections were raised by the lawyers for the prosecution, uh, mm. for the accused person. The lawyers for the accused person indicated that these 12 people standing trial before the court 
are people with good repute and they have people who would back them with sureties. And so they shouldn't, the court shouldn't listen to what prosecution is saying and deny them bail. Now, prosecu- uh, prosecution said, yes, indeed, they have been able to prove beyond reasonable fact that they can be able to take care of um, the persons that are standing trial, counter to allegations that they have not been well fed to that the head of legal at the regional um, police command, that is Accra Regional Police Command, indicated that, yes, indeed, he has supervised proper feeding of these 12 accused and that they were fed with papaya and their feeding um, budget has mm. been allocated for them to be fed twice a day. So it is never true the objection being raised by, by the... Uh, mm. By the, um, how do you call it? By the, uh, Elvis. Assist, um, mm. the assist person's lawyers that indeed they have not been taken care of. So the court, in its wisdom, mm. listened to both parties and indicated that, yes, to this effect, I am remanding the 12 into police custody. They shouldn't be in prison, but they should be in police remand. And this Prosecution was mm. very happy with the decision of the court and even mentioned that the accused persons are in separate cells, right. not in a cramped cells as they mm. have been told by the court, by the accused person. Right, lawyer. right. So, Frank, this is a summary of mm. what happened in court today. Elvis, thanks for the clarity on um, the cells over there. But again, before I let you go, I want uh, to tell me about the posturing of the accused persons in court today. So the accused persons came very strong and very okay, mm. counter to what has been reported by social media posts and other um, um, media platforms that they have not been well treated. Now, when you take Oliver Baka Vomawar, for instance, you could definitely see that he has been given medical attention. So he has his infusion line set on his wrist, mm. and he was made to sit in court. Um, as the others were standing. And the others who were, um, the 11 others who were in court today looked mm. very healthy and they looked well fed. Right. So mm. this is what I can report on, um, Fritz. Elvis, many thanks for your time. And Yahweh, what do you mean? What do you mean by saying Yahweh? Me and my brother, me and my brother, and they're free, Sunano West, or do not have first time school, and they're called. Under the CI, under the CI 91, and the CI 27, no. But the other one, I can say, tell me, you can say, over CI 127, no. Transferred voters list, regression 22, no. I can prefer say, a registered voter who before an election is resident for not less than 12 months in a constituency other than, other than that in the registered voter is registered may apply it may apply to the returning officer of the constituency where the registered voter is resident for the name of the registered voter to be entered on the transfer voter list of a polling station in that country. But I can tell you, 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 I can and to what travel be a less than that was not now more can I not perform a transfer me vote and be a job in a demo me clear me do what I'm going to say my mother to let you know and to me transfer me vote to a bunch of you what the man I'm going to be part of my money or to return an officer that I'm going to be part of my return an officer now we are now question for me more to call my say I'm going to independent audit. Um, chairman Edema, the new Patriotic Party.